the road was blocked off because they were working on Shore's jewelry. Um, it was a very unfortunate situation that happened and it could have been a lot worse. We had some smoke smell in here. There's really no smoke damage. Um, and we thought we had water damage, but we didn't. Kara James, an employee at Merrill Norman Cosmetics, two doors down from Shores Jewelry Store, says the damage done to Shores is devastating. She says although the cosmetic store wasn't hit hard by the blaze, other surrounding businesses were. Since we were a little bit further over, we didn't get as much issues. Well, Luigi's next door, they got hit a lot harder than we did um, since they were a lot closer to Shores Jewelry. The Downtown Diner, which is a really popular restaurant here, they were affected by it as well. Despite the destruction, Jane says she's grateful the fire department and other people within the community have been helpful with getting through this tragedy. I'm really happy that, like I said, that the fire department, the EMT, came to the rescue and was able to help the situation. It's unfortunate what happened to Shores because it was a family-owned business that's been around here for a long time. It's part of history. In Mentoon, I'm Carmen Emanuel for WEIU Newswatch.